lot of protection in the first half. You get a lot of chips, a lot of doubles. A lot of slides, protection, but I don't even think. Uh, I mean, if you if you look at the game and true drop back and rushes, I think I had, you know, I was doing what I usually do, ball coming out fast, which what you would expect. Um, but it's just a game where it just never came into our favor, you know. It never came into where he had to drop back and think to make the big throw or things like that. It was always a. Uh, he could have did whatever he wanted to. The full playbook was open. And it's just hard to play against, you know, um, when you're playing from behind uh, with a slow start. And that's just the reality of football. A lot of offsides on the defense. Is that just interpretation of the reps? I think it's a little bit of both. You know, I think it was something the Cardinals had said uh, early on because the ref came to me and talked to me about um, if I wanted to tell him if I lined up a neutral, edging it, things like that. So I definitely think uh, they was calling it. Um, but yeah, I think we just beat ourselves. We put ourselves behind the eight ball a couple times and just, you know, it just wasn't uh, championship football. With the run fits, was it anything that they showed you that you didn't expect or was it y'all not executing? It was, it was just us not executing, us being flat, uh, us, you know, trying to make a play instead of just making plays together, you know, and, and that just tends to happen. Um, so we just need to look at the film, fix where we messed up and just never make the same mistake twice. That's how you get better. I mean, the outcome is definitely shocking. Uh, it definitely hurts. Um, anytime you compete, it hurts to lose. But uh, I take ownership, you know. Uh, I take on full ownership, um, you know, just because I feel like uh, I give the team a lot of energy and I feel like I got to give more energy. I got to bring these guys together. We got to come together um, so we can play better on defense. So I take full ownership. It is. Uh, losing a guy like Trayvon, Trayvon, me and Trayvon feed off each other. Um, you know, that's really like my brother. Like, you know, I talked to him already after the game. And it's just, it's tough to lose like someone, but we know he, we got his support. And we got to play harder for Trayvon. We got to play harder for him because I know how much he wants to be out here and the emotions he felt uh, after energy. So we got to be better for him. We know that you should be better for yourself. What's, what's your message to your fellow defensive team? Uh, my message for us is never stress, never worry. Let's just get better. I like it's still early on in the season. This is this is the tough part about playing the National Football League. Every team has its day. You know, um, the last two weeks we was light on fire, and today we came out and we got lit. And that's just the reality of football. And, you know, and you look across the league, it happened to a couple teams. You know, reality sets in. You look at the Chiefs. Everyone thought the Chiefs would go out and blow out the Lions. The Lions came out lit and fired up. So um, the reality is, we got taken every game is like the Super Bowl. And we got to play up to our standard. We can't play down to teams, and I felt like that's what we did today. Thank you, Micah.